Where are we going, kid? <laughs> Glastonbury! <laughs> <laughs> and it's chucking it down with rain. <laughs> Thank you. There you go, and then just wristband there. Cheers. Thank you. Oh, I like them this year. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Oh. Yeah, brilliant. I like that this yeah. year. Yeah. I like the colour scheme. Yeah. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Glastonbury 2023 vlogs. <laughs> Today is Wednesday. We've just come into the festival for the first time. We thought. We've waited for the downpour to, to go by and it has more or less. So fingers crossed that's it for the for the day. So yeah, we're just coming in and uh, it's starting to rain again. <laughs> it's, I think if this is going to be a traditional Glastonbury, isn't it? Yeah, showers and then sunshine. I think the forecast is looking good for the rest of the weekend, so I'm not too worried. There's quite a bit different already. I'm at Williams Green and the Williams Green stage has gone. And instead there's Carr Henge and a giant cat or dog. That's so clever. Look at his little fawn. <laughs> oh, they're, bump they're old fairground bumper cars. <laughs> Well, the sun has come out and I can't believe how hot it is. <laughs> We're boiling now. If we just stayed at home for another hour, we think we might have missed oh, all the bad right. weather. Mind yeah. you, the clouds are looking quite black over there. So we shall see what happens. <laughs> so we've picked up our maps. We didn't get the t-shirt. We very often get the t-shirt, but the queue is too long. So we're going to come back for that later. What's the plan now then? I don't know. I mean, I know we did sort of want to go over to the green field. So we, if there were any, and use of the crafting field. So if there were any workshops we wanted to do, we could sign up for them nice and early. Yeah. Let's go and look at Carhenge properly. Okay and make our way up slowly yeah. I guess. We do usually do shopping on this day. Yeah we do, we? we do. It's a good shopping day. Should be a nice day looking about, getting our bearings, seeing the new things because yeah. I think there's a, we can see quite a few changes from our garden. Oh by the way I haven't really introduced myself. <laughs> Let me do that now. <laughs> Welcome if you're new to the channel. If you're here with the Glastonbury content I hope you enjoy it. I'll be doing separate videos I think for the festival so there'll be one each day so please hit subscribe please remember to come back and watch the next one I'll take you around and we'll see what we see and do what we do yeah so we live in Pilton so that's why we get into the villagers car park the villagers entrance so we don't have to queue a little perk of putting up with all the traffic and everything else all the other palaver of living in the village where the festival takes place so that might explain that if you were wondering why we got special treatment there <laughs> Okay, anything else I need to say to introduce to the, oh. to the new folks of the channel, watching the channel? I this is my daughter know. Rain, by the way. <laughs> I suppose that how long you've come to Glastonbury, even before oh, we yes. moved here. So we moved here about 15 years ago, but we've been going to the festival every time since 1995, when I was pregnant with this one. <laughs> so you'll probably see my husband and my other daughter throughout the weekend. Babbling on. I'm babbling on now. <laughs> Let's get on with it. <laughs> These will provide some shade. That's true. Gosh, it's so weird. <laughs> there has been a car hend once before at Glastonbury, but um, I didn't see it. I don't know if I just didn't go to that area or whether it was before my time. It's very cool. I love the artwork. <laughs> How do they stay upright? <laughs> Just saying how much this art really captures the atmosphere and the vibrance of the festival. I bought two prints here last year so I've got nowhere else to put any new ones but they are so good. The artist is... I love those collection of bins. <laughs> <laughs> the fruits, the pastel. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I like those flowers. 
If you would like to add some Glastonbury Festival magic into your wardrobe, then please take a look at threadsofafairytale.com for sustainable, unique fashion handmade by me here in Pilton. First meal of the festival demolished. Sauté potatoes. Honestly, this is the best food in the festival. I'm so glad they're back every year. We are right opposite the sauna. I think the entrance to the naughty corner is just here, if you're looking for it in the future. Six pounds for a plate and it's so filling. Good morning. <laughs> I've just had a little nap. I'm up in the back of the craft field. It's such a lovely, lovely atmosphere. I'm just so happy to be here again. It's so nice. Anyway, I've woken up, had a cereal bar, I feel ready to get going again. And I think we're gonna look around the craft field and maybe in a few more stalls, a bit more shopping. And then, yeah, we'll see what happens. Pro might meet up with the rest of the family. I'm, I'm not sure if Chris, my husband, is coming in or not. He might not. He's been in Bristol working all day, so yeah, he might not today. Okay, that's my little, little update. <laughs> it's so nice, it's so cool here. Let me show you what I'm looking at because I'm under this sort of grove of oak trees. It's just beautiful. Ready to get going again? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's so funny that we came in in that rain and now it's just boiling hot and everyone's like stripping off, getting the sun cream out. Luckily, I brought sun cream. You need, it's like any English holiday. You still need to pack for every eventuality, yeah. every, every type of weather, <laughs> every single type of weather. And uh, all, at all at once. But also, you're carrying it on your shoulders all day long, particularly for us because we haven't got a tent to take it back to. Oh dear. <laughs> Honestly, weather. Weather. So cool. Oh yeah, that is a cute bin. Oh, my dad's <laughs> on a t-shirt. Yeah. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Jude's joined us. We're just going back along this bit here and it's a beautiful, beautiful evening. I think the more bluey purple. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, like mom, I We're buying one of these fridge magnets. We realised we haven't got one for Glastonbury Festival. These are so cool. day one we've come home and i think the opening ceremony is going on over there waiting for the firework mm. waiting for the traffic waiting for the fireworks because that's always fun to watch before going to bed well it's a good first day um it's a shame they're not allowed to do the music properly amplified so we sat down at the end there to watch three daft monkeys which is a good stancy folk band that we like to see they're there most years we couldn't hear them and we, you had to get really close and of course it was crowded because they're wasn't much else on but anyway it was really nice walking around I did a little bit of shopping I bought a top that I thought was a skirt <laughs> I will be able to adjust it and turn it into a skirt that shouldn't be a problem found a couple of bargains a five pound rail you don't see those very often anymore at the festival well I hope you enjoyed watching I'll leave you with the fireworks please hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed it please subscribe if you're new here don't forget to come back to watch the rest of the festival and I'll see you again soon take care Bye. This is That's a wedding dress. dress. <laughs> <laughs> and the occasion was... <laughs> fairy ball. Yeah, fairy ball. A labyrinth ball. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, fireworks. Hey.